Doing WNBA player props here on Price Picks. Before I get started, there's a link in the description below to sign up for Price Picks. 100% deposit match on your first deposit, or you can use code TUFF to sign up. There's a free Discord link in the description as well as Patreon link where I give all my bonus plays, all the plays I'm making that day on Price Picks for each given sport: college football, WNBA, MLB, NBA coming up very very soon. Obviously NFL. Super excited about that. Daily, daily, multiple daily posts on Patreon every single day. So go ahead and check that link out. Let's get into it, you guys. WNBA Finals Game 2. Now, Game 1 here was a pretty close game, not a super high-scoring game, 67-64, to 64, and 23 total points scored in the fourth quarter. So I think we could see kind of a something similar to this in this next game, or Game 2 tonight. Uh, you know, two teams fighting it out, obviously aggressive on both ends of the floor. WNBA Finals, so super exciting. I'm glad the game was close. I think this entire series will be a pretty close series, which is... I think good for us as far as making prop bets on this game specifically. Um, but yeah, I'm going to give three total player props that I like here. Um, WNBA Finals game two, three props. Let's not waste any time, you guys. Let's get right into it. Again, I just do want to mention I'm not a financial advisor. This is not gambling advice. These are just plays I'm personally looking at making, giving you guys insight, help you guys make your own plays. But let's get into it. The first play that I like is going to be a rebounding prop, and we're going to do Alyssa Thomas over nine and a half now. In game one, this prop was at nine, and we took the over. And you can see here, she's obviously hit this four of her last five. She had ten. Uh, she had eleven rebounds against Vegas, and this season actually against Las Vegas, she's faced Las Vegas um, for, for all four times this season. And let's just see. So Las Vegas here, eleven rebounds. She played Vegas down here um, on July seventeenth, had fourteen rebounds. Faced Vegas right here on June second, had twelve rebounds, and then faced Vegas here on May 31st and had 11 rebounds. So it has literally had nine or 10 plus rebounds every time she's faced Vegas this year. I do think this line, again, jumping up from nine to nine and a half, a little bit high. Las Vegas Aces do allow the third most rebounds in the league. Obviously being down 0-1, Alyssa Thomas is gonna see massive minutes in this game. You can see here, I mean, 36 minutes in this game. I think she sees at least 35 plus minutes. Um, complete Swiss Army knife for the Connecticut Sun. I like the over here on this one of nine and a half rebounds. Uh, the next prop is going to be a blocks and steals, and it's going to be Asia Wilson over three. Now, during the season, like you know, back a month ago, a month and a half ago, anytime I saw Asia Wilson at three point zero blocks and steals, I was taking the over on this one every single time. Um, she's hit this six of seven times in the playoffs so far. Uh, really quickly, if we take a look at her last five, she, you know. Push her better in her last five, three, three, four, four, and six blocks and steals in that game one against Connecticut. I'm kind of surprised this is at three. I think this has a chance maybe to bump up to three and a half. So if you do see this and you like it at three, um, I recommend taking it right now. But um, she's going to play close to 40 minutes in this game here, game two. Um, anytime she's played pretty much 35 plus minutes, she's hit this like 11 of 12 times. Again, six of seven times she's actually hit this during the playoffs. So I mean, you can see here, even the postseason, five uh, blocks of steals, three, one, three, three, four, four, and six. So at three, I think at bare minimum, we're looking at a push here for Asia Wilson. Love this play. I'm taking the over on this one of three blocks and steals for Asia Wilson. And then the last play is going to be a turnovers, and it's going to be Chelsea Gray. Now, Chelsea Gray has been playing amazing. She's been playing, like, absolutely incredible. If you take a look really quickly at her fantasy score, like, she's been playing on another level, right? Had, kind of having a tough game, game one here. Uh, Connecticut has some good defenders at the guard positions, but I like Chelsea Gray over her turnovers here of two, considering she has hit this um, three of her push and then three of her last four, five games, but had six turnovers here in game one against Connecticut. Connecticut does force the most turnovers in the WNBA, right? Most turnovers in the WNBA. And Chelsea Gray, obviously, is going to have the ball in her hands for quite a bit of time. Um, her and Kelsey Plum kind of rotate as far as primary ball handling duties, but Chelsea Gray, I mean, she's going to play 30 plus minutes in this game. Um, when you watch the game, if you turn the game on, like Chelsea Gray has the ball in her hands like every single time. And she is the main facilitator for this team at two uh, turnovers. I like this play a lot over. If it was at three, I would kind of stay away from it. But at two, I think there's some good value here for Chelsea Gray, considering she did have six in game one. Obviously, she's going to try to limit the turnovers in game two. Um, I watched the, the 
post game interview she was kind of she felt bad about having six turnovers so i hope i'm assuming she's going to probably try to cut those down but at two turnovers um for a player that has the ball in her hands quite a bit main facilitator uh all it takes for connecticut to get in those passing lines a few times i like the over here on chelsea great turnovers of two so these are the three total player props i'm taking here for the WNBA nba finals WNBA finals game two Elsa thomas over nine and a half rebounds asia wilson over three blocks and steals and chelsea gray over two turnovers let me know in the comments below you guys feel about these props Please drop a like on this video, hit the subscribe button, and as always, you guys have a great day.